Peyton Manning and Gary Kubiak's offense, not an offense he's familiar with. Definitely a different pace, the zone blocking scheme coming in. Uh, what did you see the differences there with Manning running the offense and then when Brock Osweiler came in? Well, I think over the past two weeks, you've seen what John Elway was talking about when he was talking about this offense is going to look different going into the future. It's going to look like what he ran back in the 80s when I was playing against him. And that's going to feature that zone blocking scheme, stretch, inside outside zone type of offense and play action. And Brock has looked beautiful in that. And you saw it against the Seattle Seahawks. You saw it early in this game. Now the wheels fell off a little bit for him in the second half. But you saw exactly what John was talking about. When Peyton was in there, it kind of looked like Peyton and Demarius Thomas has had to deal like, hey, let's just try and get on the same page since we haven't played together in a game yet. But you didn't see the same kind of flow and rhythm that I thought was beautiful in the first week of the preseason and early when Brock was in there. I think Brock Osweiler has answered a lot of questions for John Elway and maybe for the league in general. That being, when you put him in a situation where he knows he's going to start, and you tailor an offense to him that features some movement in the pocket, some big down the field throws, some high percentage throws, and a strong running game, Brock Osweiler can play quarterback in this league. Yes or no, is this offense a good fit for Peyton Manning? It's yet to be determined because you haven't seen it in game action. Week three will be big for him to see exactly what it's going to look like when he's under center because we know what it will look like if Brock has to play.